Hey, video game stuff. There right. was some huge ass game stuff. Name this week. one. That's right. Knack two is real. <laughs> uh, Nintendo did their big conference. Yeah. This yeah. week, the Switch. <laughs> they came out. All cards are on the table. All the cards are on the table. By the way, I'm gonna cut you off. Yeah. Uh -oh. Good. I found, a, I found a. I found a Switch is somebody oh, yeah. who gets dominated. Yep. Yeah, and we, is also submissive. We did find oh. that out. They just traded. They change it up. Well, seemed well, everyone yeah. about there Nintendo, and huh. everyone seemed to I be. Think it's a progressive move for Nintendo. That's even Switch. Like now I know the reference. Anyways, continue. Yeah, so no, I, point I, that no, out. I, I think that's good. You pointed that out. Now we know. All the cards are on the table <laughs> now. <laughs> now yeah. for sure. Uh, but anyway, they showed. They had this big conference. It was what I didn't expect. It was a keynote. Which, Which I, I thought, thought they were done with. I thought Nintendo yeah. had said goodbye to the keynote format. I thought, oh, we're going to get a Nintendo Direct and they're going to yeah. just tell us. Yeah. And then we get this Japanese keynote where timing is off on things. And oh, people it's... are going, we're going to go to... We're going to switch. <laughs> um, <laughs> and cut, switch. Cut. And, you know, no and it was That's like, great. man, I thought, you know... I thought Nintendo was brilliant for getting away from that. Mm -hmm. At first, when they when they did that, it was like, what are they doing? They're not going to have a keynote? But hey, the Nintendo Direct, they dominate that format. It's yeah, great. And I want to point out... And they're submissive to it as well. Yeah, Switch. <laughs> <laughs> and I want to point out That's great. that all the people hosting, everyone hosting the key, this keynote format, it was all the Japanese executives. And then when it went to... Well, okay, now uh, Reggie has something to say about the new Zelda. It went to this nice pre-recorded bit of him and Miyamoto and Aonuma, the director of Zelda. Mm -hmm. It's almost like the true creatives of the company said, no, this is, this is what we do. Like, yeah. like, like I, I wonder if the keynote format was a, an order from the top. Maybe. Versus their wishes. It Do you was, know what I mean? It was yeah. weird. Because their part was polished and to the point. Because yeah. they were being like, everyone was kind of dressed up for what they were talking about. Like yeah. the Splatoon guy and the Mario guy. Yeah. And it was kind of weird. Because it was like, oh no, just show me yeah. the game. Yeah, It was really bizarre. <laughs> just but show me the my game. My favorite part was the uh, English translators. They Trying to keep up. <laughs> not just trying to keep up. They're like, they had no... One of them had absolutely no intention of making anything exciting sound exciting. Yeah. <laughs> oh, and there it is. Yeah. New, uh, Can you believe it? New Mario uh, Galaxy uh, Odyssey. Play the game today. Mario <laughs> Odyssey uh, looks rad. Yeah. Um, I wish I could live in New Donk City. Yeah, yeah. me too. I, I wish I could be. I love the name New Donk, New Donk City. City. It sounds like a city full of prosthetic butts. I, uh, yeah, I down, saw down a, a lot of complaints about the that Mario Odyssey game. What were they? What I saw I was saw they didn't like that Mario was not human. That's hilarious. And that was my first question, too. Why is Mario shorter than all the humans? <laughs> is he inhuman? Well, is he, is here's he, what I hear when you say that. Is he a little person? Here's what I hear when you say that. You just said that short people aren't people. So shame on you for that. Fuck. Derek's words, not mine. Shame on him for Fuck, that. Those it, dude. were my words, <laughs> yeah. not Rocco's. But I agree. He's from the Mushroom Kingdom. No, he's yeah. not. He's from New York. I think that I think that has all that's gone a John by the Leguizamo way. You shit. think that there's like some lost level twist to his I origin think story? Because then, guess what? Yoshi's Island. What happened? The what? Storks delivered Mario's ba the Mario the baby, baby to Mario. some like weird Mushroom Kingdom house. I think his I think his backstory is But changed. Baby Mario and Mario are not the same. They are the No, same Baby person. Mario is is he exists at the same time as Mario. They can race How each can other. How could they be the same oh, person? He does. They True. race no. each other in Mario can. Kart. Maybe Mario's they Mario's interact. Son. Yeah, I think he is. Mario no, Jr. Doing, Mario, Mario, oh, and you Peach. know Mario has sex with Peach, yeah. but they can't that. show that in the Nintendo games. You know that That's happens. the cake he's coming over to get. Yeah, Baby Mario is. I never thought yeah. of that. Baby Mario is the son of Mario. They're doing Terminator stuff. That's not. No. And Mario. It's from New York, and Mario, Baby Mario, is from the Mushroom, Mushroom Kingdom. Kingdom. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that makes the most sense. Okay, well, that's the case. So yeah, yeah we, we all agree. Everyone, anyway, and, 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 and Miyamoto worked on the Super Mario Brothers movie, which right. shows their backstory from New York. Yeah, you? canon. Oh, you? canon. 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 You? <laughs> what if the impact that that meteorite created an alternate dimension where dinosaurs continued to thrive? 
I remember most of it. Anyway. Very nice. Whoa. Congratulations. Sorry. Thank you. Code song. What a waste of space Thank in your brain. <laughs> There's a lot of waste of space in there. Anyway. But he doesn't remember anything from Willy Wonka. <laughs> Not a word. Not a started. single word. Uh, but anyway, uh, that trailer was the first time I got goosebumps from a Mario game trailer since, I don't 64? I don't know. Like, in wow. so long. That trailer made me, me so excited for a Mario game. I get goosebumps from Mario trailers on a daily basis. <laughs> Yo, when you turn in fact, into a it's cat, like a problem for me. I was into it. If you I show so me a Mario trailer, I, I basically order that. That's how I got in the affiliate panel, too. <laughs> was the Mario trailer. I got up and I, I have Marioism. Uh, <laughs> Mario play. I need pipes in the room. Um, um, but anyway. Yeah, play. Uh, uh, no, but, but my, so my opinion on this, tell me what you thought. Okay. But, this presentation, the whole, as a whole, everything they showed, I thought it was. Now I have to say, a lot of the games they showed in this conference were like a direct pipeline to my interests. I mean, fucking Xenoblade Chronicles Two, Two yeah. came out of nowhere. A new game with Travis Touchdown from No More Heroes. That'd be oh sick. my god! All this stuff. I thought it was. Awesome! What is awesome. the game called? With the Travis touchdown. They, they haven't said yet. He came he might, out and said, We're, "We've got a new project on the way." He might not. That. I feel like he's not even going to be the main character of the game. Maybe I think not. he's just going to be in it. He talked about wrestling. Yeah. He it's, did a so, wrestling pose at the beginning. Yeah. yeah. There's a lot of rumors. Uh, this is some kind of wrestling project with him involved in it. Good, I'm in. Dude, that'd be um, awesome. That's with, all my interest with, right there. And and Suda fifty one said he's like for the first time in a long time since the original No More Heroes, he is writing and directing oh. whatever this is like. Like every, basically every step of it. Nice. Like he's not no help. It's like Good. he's you know. Well, I mean, he'll have help. Suda. Anyway, uh, I thought it was a lot of awesome stuff wrapped in very confusing decisions. <laughs> That's yeah. how I felt. Yeah, the keynote itself was like, I didn't know what to look at and, and, or like and, what and to it was care about. Lots of uh, you know, um, yeah, and the system's going to be online, which you'll pay for. What? Um, I will. I, yeah. The, They've never been able to figure out. Yeah, their online's always been terrible. You know, it, and and that's the thing is like, at least you know Sony charges now, but they made great strides to get to a great thing before they did that. Yeah, and I'm scared because at Nintendo, I I rarely go online because I feel like it's still not really working. You know, mm -hmm. sometimes it is. I mean, their online is stable. I I played games online and yeah. it doesn't cut out. That's right. great, but. But it's still not quite figured out. And then they bring up, well, yeah, you'll pay for it. Also, it uses a smartphone app. You'll use voice voice chat and, and communication is all through a smartphone app. What? It, it was just very like, wait, what, what is happening? What is happening? But then they would show, okay, well, here's the Mario trailer. Fuck yeah, this is great. And, you know, and then there'd be another thing, you know. Uh, for the, I will say this. For the first 15 minutes of the conference, one, I was blindsided it was a keynote, like we said. Right. But they spent the first 15 minutes on motion the, the control controls. games. And it, yeah. it, it was, was like, it, what year is this? You know, it was funny. I, I, watched, I was watching that with the kids. It was like 8 o'clock our time, so we yeah. were watching it. And they kept talking about the Joy-Con controllers. And, and this <laughs> game, you don't even need a TV. You don't even need to be because you have the Joy-Con controllers. Just and look then, at each other. And then so Emma goes, so then it's not a video game. No. <laughs> yeah. Like, what, what is this? It was just what very baffling. And, and and so, yeah, here's all these mini games that uh, use the, the – it's like we're doing motion controls but, again. But then it wasn't – I was waiting for them to say it's included. And it's not. Yeah, that's, that what? to me – Wii Sports what? was included, which yeah. made sense because that showed you the technology and yeah. it showed you what it was. This – Whatever, one two switch. What's that called? One two buckle mushroom. What, what's that fucking game one, called? One two switch. Yeah. One two switch. Yeah, yeah th <laughs> that being sixty bucks, like who is gonna pay for this? Oh, not it, this. it was a weird situation. I'll, I'll just say this: my appeal in the switch. First of all, it is a Nintendo machine, and there, you know, there was a lot of talk of. I don't know if the launch is that strong. Do you think it's gonna be worth it? Do you think it's good? I know what games this thing's gonna get over the next five years. I, I already know, and I'm I'm fine. Nintendo is is a constant in my life, and I'm fine to keep playing their systems, and you know. So I'm not really in for you know. I, I know what it's going to have, but the appeal of this particular device to me is the portability. I yeah. play portable games all the. I have more time to play those than regular console games, and to have it as both. Oh, I'm so happy. That's the strength of it. So when they spend the first twenty minutes doing motion control things, I'm yeah. like, well, I'm not doing this on a plane. I'm not doing this at the office. 
I'm not doing, you know, it's like that. the strength of it is not being utilized here. We're yeah. doing the Wii again. Like, yeah. what, what are, it was such a confusing message to me. I, I didn't, I was left really cool. So thank God, they, then they showed Mario and then they talked about those other games and then ended on that incredible Zelda trailer. Man. Yeah, which the, before, yeah. I told the we last one and I was it. like, oh, I don't like this. I, I didn't care. Literally, really. the, the thing we talked about on the podcast was, you know, this game needs to grow up a little bit. Yeah. yeah. And then we get this trailer that is not only dark. I mean, I mean, Princess Zelda is, is in the rain crying to Link about. She looks like she's a mess. Yeah. And there's something going on and there's voice acting. I think that was the thing we specifically brought up. Like, yeah. it has voice acting. It's this intensely cut trailer and it, it, it like, it got me pumped to play it. Yeah. And I hadn't felt that. I you just know? want to say, fuck the patriarchy. How come Link can't cry and look like a mess? Yeah. When I, I, I just want to, I just want to say thank I mean, you. Is it not the Switch? Thank you. Yeah, exactly. When is 2017. When How come it should have Ganon crying? Yeah. And it should just be that. Exactly. They need to make the entire Link a game. girl. But what when? About time. But I will say, uh, you know, so they announced that's a launch game, which didn't really. I mean. Surprising and not surprising, I guess. Uh, I thought it was going to be delayed again, but but good. It's it's a launch. Game. Now, but yeah. do you get that on Switch or do you get that on Wii U? I oh, get on Switch. I'm gonna get on Switch. Thousand percent Switch. Yeah, it will run better, bigger, better, everything on Switch. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I've seen side by sides. It, like it's yeah. the resolution, the clarity, just really is so much better. Ah. Yeah. Uh, but I will say, you know, it's funny because they they now okay, so that's at launch and like a couple other games. And they kind of got flack for like, wow, not that's it at launch. That's not something that's funny, and I and I feel like people don't realize this. Every launch sucks. Oh, <laughs> every yeah. system yeah. is the same thing, and everyone acts like it's a surprise every time. Right. But okay, the PS4. I feel like a lot of people lo like the PS4. It's cool hardware. What did that launch with? I mean, when that launch, people, wow, what a shit. Wow, what a <laughs> terrible feel? launch. Knack. That's it. Okay. I mean, it was like Battle Deluxe Four, Edition. The PS3, PS3 had a games. terrible launch. PS2 had a but terrible launch. But here's here's the thing that I don't understand personally. It's I can only play one game at a time. So like, yeah, I got Zelda and everything. Like, oh, just Zelda? It's like that's not enough. Like, I'm, I'm playing that nonstop. Yeah, when I mean, that comes out. Yeah. I'm excited for Zelda, but I want more. It's like, but why? You have? I mean, I don't know. Like that's me. I you know I get it. People want people want to see a, a bounty of stuff to justify their purchase. So I get right. that. But launch is always. Is never when that happens. It, yeah. It's always um, really all these systems. You know, Nintendo sixty four only had Mario sixty four. But how amazing was Mario? Yeah, 64? and yeah. if you want the rest, I mean, like by Christmas, yeah, you will have yeah. a billion titles to choose That's from. That's why yeah. they're releasing it in March, not in right. November. Right. For that so, exact reason. Really, if you if you want to talk about like a good launch, really the maybe the best launch of all time, yeah, is what? the fucking Vita. That, no. game, that really? thing had Uncharted. That, yeah. Right? Kevin, yeah. were we just talking about no. that? That thing hey, had a new Uncharted and yeah. like eight other games that were amazing. And it never gets any credit. Yeah. Wow. Uh, but most launches only have like one good game. Like that's really just how it goes. Um, Dreamcast was was had a, had kind of a good selection yeah. too. But mo for the most part, they all launch weak. You know, Speaking of, part of uh, Dreamcast having a good selection, I saw yeah. this, um, this uh, infographic today. I, I can't verify if it was accurate, mm -hmm. but I believe that it was accurate. And it was uh, video game consoles adjusted for inflation. I saw yeah, that. They would cost yeah. yeah, I saw that. The Dreamcast was the cheapest console. Yeah, yeah. blew me away. Uh, when adjusted for inflation, it was $200 when it came out. And uh, today it would cost like 272 It was like almost three. Where, yeah, where everything else, like the original Nintendo yeah. was like 500 bucks yeah. in today's prices. And like the original Atari was like close to $1,000. Right. Oh my God. Which is just so amazing because the Dreamcast, it really was like the greatest time for video games. Yeah. yeah. It, that, that, it was a hell of a deal. Yeah, yeah I remember it was a that hell being of a deal, like, I can't afford but this But it, it was also a massive step in technology. Yeah. Yeah. It was the most affordable console ever released. And it had a great lineup of games. And they went out of business. And they went out <laughs> of business. Was, hey, I wonder why. <laughs> no, uh, well, if you remember, I think they were shell-shocked because if you remember now, what's funny about that is the Saturn when that came out was 400. 400 I then. Did. I don't yeah. remember because I didn't have a Saturn. Yeah, I, I didn't either. 400 then. Yeah. I mean, right now, 400 is, ooh, 400. Yeah, yeah, 400. Ooh, 400 then. Yeah. And so, yeah, I think they were really trying to compensate. Like, 
you know, the, the plan was really to get as many people on the system as possible because they'll buy the games. Yeah. So I think they sold the system at a major loss. Yeah. Uh, and I maybe, remember hearing maybe that. that contributed to where they... Yeah. I, th I think it was mostly the pirating of the yeah, game. Yeah, I think burning games so easily. Yeah. You well, well, in all honesty, their business model relied on people buying a lot of games. Yeah. And, and so, then, yeah, you factor in burning how easy it was. Oh, my yeah, God. I got, like, a stack this big of Dreamcast <laughs> games at home. Yeah. I mean, I was always... Allegedly. I was and super... And now Sega's out of business. I was always super... I was a good kid with that stuff. Like, I, I was always... I would buy... You know, I was... I, I didn't pirate a lot of stuff. I would try to buy what I could and, you know, whatever. But Dreamcast was so easy, and I couldn't buy Power Stone 2 at Walmart. So yeah, I was yeah. like, well, I'm downloading that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Absolutely. I had, I had a huge stack. Absolutely. I never for burned sure. a game for Dreamcast. I could never. I never a bunch of Japanese out. ones. <laughs> Super quick talking about the, the Switch at launch. Yeah. There are a bunch of people in the chat going, why would you buy it at launch? Like, you could get a PS4 or, a, uh, or an Xbox One. Sure. And I think comparing those... Isn't necessarily fair. Yeah, yeah, it's a console, but yeah. like if you think, they're not going for that. If you think the Switch is going to replace what either one of yeah. those two do, not at all. you're in for a rude awakening. It doesn't do that. No, it plays not Mario. Yeah, it plays yeah. Zelda. Yeah, it plays Mario Kart where you can be Zelda. Right, and that's yeah. the extent. And, yep. yeah. and you can go to New Donk City. Don't expect to go to Grand Theft Auto San right. Andreas. Like, <laughs> that's yeah. not, that's really, not what it's for. Personally, I feel like I have. My Nintendo console, and then mm -hmm. I choose between the Xbox, Xbox and the PS4. Exactly. Okay. I choose that, and then I that, pick. That's all. Plus, yeah. hey, everybody out there, your dollars matter. Okay, so if you don't think it's worth buying, don't buy it. 100%. And maybe next time when they have a new console, they'll yeah. they'll have a nice batch of games to entice you yeah. uh, to buying it. So yeah. you know, let them know what you think. Yeah, but I, I will say though, uh, I, I I you know they announced the price and all that two ninety nine. I think that's great for a console that becomes a. HD portable, like yeah, I'm happy with that. Yeah. Um, I will say the accessories around it are all like twenty or thirty percent too high. That's crazy. Oh, yeah, like, like, and I, I, I never balk about games. You know, I buy game stuff all the time, and I and I don't balk. These, it's actually like I would have bought a second controller. I, ooh, Seventy bucks. I'm not. Or something? Yeah, yeah. I mean, For every two, every yeah. piece of it costs something. Yeah, that is it's a, a little lot. too much. Um, yeah. Do you think that maybe yeah. they're making up for like? Uh, lack of sales on the Wii U? I don't know. Yeah, because uh, Nintendo historically, um, I think, has... Oh, I think they made money off I of I think they make money consoles. off of all their consoles. Maybe the Wii U they didn't. I don't, I don't know. Huh. But, I mean, they made That's so much money off of the Wii and the and the DS and the 3DS that I feel yeah. like it that has to kind of, like, mix it. Ago. I mean, DS, well, DS the 3DS and 3DS sells keep releasing or just keep keeps, coming. Yeah, like yeah. The new 3DS or whatever they yeah. do, it always sells. Yeah. So. Crazy that the Wii came out 2008. Yeah, six. 2006. 2006. Wow, 11 years 11 ago. 11 years ago. Now, I say almost 10 years. Yeah. My mind was 2008. Damn, it's a decade ago. The Wii. Yeah. You could probably find one in 2008. That's probably what that's, you think. Yeah, that's when it got yeah. wide, yeah. widely released. That's, yeah, it was geez. so hard to it was, it was hard to find for a long time. I, yeah. It's funny, the first week the Wii came out, you could find them. Yeah. Because it hadn't quite caught yet. It was like, there what is how the much Wii? TV? Okay. There was like daytime and like yeah, uh, there was a nighttime lot of television segments devoted to Wii. Yeah. So I just think eventually it was like people's parents wanted to buy Wii. Yeah. yeah. Do you remember Bill had one in True Blood? No. He really? Had a Wii in his house. Yeah. He had like oh, his, wait. his lair and then he had the Wii in there. And they're like, what is this? And he's like, I ain't got to kill the time. Yeah. yeah. And it does ring a bell. He had I remember Wii. all my friends' parents had it. Yeah. yeah. Like, Grandparents that, wanted to get it for yeah, the grandkids yeah. to come over. Grandparents play. would be playing it too. And, and that's what kind of surprises me that's is they like for. they Nintendo got the biggest, broadest audience with that system. Yeah. But then got burned by them because that same crowd on a dime went to smartphones. As soon yeah. as smartphones yeah. came around, so, yeah. 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 done. Wow, that's really interesting. Candy that's really really good point. Right. And and wow. so that's what fascinates me is they they. It's like I, I kind of felt like the beginning of this conference they were trying to like get those people back, but it's like man, these this that's the crowd that turned and forgot about you instantly. Yeah, mm -hmm. go yeah. make Mario run for them right. on iOS. But I feel like with your console, you've got such a dedicated base that is ready for Mario and, and all these core games. I would just think you would focus on that and not... I, I don't know. I, I, I just... My brother was there as I was watching the thing, and he was so eager for them to skip over the milking or, you know, whatever yeah. they're doing in these mini games. <laughs> yeah. So, get to, you know, he said, get to the real games. And it's like, yeah, that's an interesting phrasing. Get to the real games. Yeah. Because this... They have we did this already. That wants... 
real, real games. games. Yeah. And when we got a big world Mario game, that's a real, oh man, I'm ready to like explore that. And I'm ready, you know, I, I was just surprised that them trying to still kind of touch that audience when they had been so burned before. Mm -hmm. But I don't know. I mean, they, they made trillions of dollars off that audience too. So I guess that's why. Somebody yeah. in the chat made a hilarious point a little yeah. while ago. They said, you could play one, two switch without a console. Just use your imagination. Yeah. 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 That. I, I think cool. that's fucking hilarious. Yeah. And when you yeah. say when, when you, you say, say get to the real games, yeah. and when you say Emma says where are the video games, yeah, maybe they should reexamine. Yeah, when you exactly you don't what they're TV, doing over there. I can't visualize that. Yeah, you know what? You don't even need the screen, right? Like no. in those games, uh, I, the I, new the, controllers have such sensitive touch in them. They have new. It's, it's, it's HD. Like, Vibrate uh, HD haptic feedback, HD rumble, rumble, HD rumble, and I think that's basically what it is. Okay, they said you can actually feel like if you're playing the new tennis game, you can feel where it hits on the paddle, like specifically, oh, cool. okay. like impact of the ball. They they used an example of pouring gla uh, ice into a glass, and you could feel the cubes stack up inside. Oh, that's really like, cool. Like it feels like there are objects inside the controller, things like that. So it's a lot of games where you're meant to like kind of feel it, and know right. when to. Which you know, is whatever. not something what? that you can just look at a video and say, okay, like I need to, see, right. I need to hold that in my hand. And, and see I'd be happy to, to play the. I'd love to try those out. Yeah. I wish it was included. If it was included, I yeah. would try that. But I'm not going to try that. Uh, Jeff, you know, I, I you know. So Seems I like love Nintendo. Word. I'm a huge fan of Nintendo. No, it's like one, one of my favorite <laughs> things. Nice. But but yeah, Jeff Jeff Keeley was on Twitter and he tried them all out and he's like, it's fun. I just can't trouble work. I can't fun. get people to pay fifty bucks for this. I I no. really I wish it was included. Yeah. So, yeah. <sighs> was, so and I, like I said, cool stuff wrapped in strange. And man, decisions. I know it's, it's gonna happen. Someone's gonna lose their fucking screen and their console's gone. Like if you, it's yeah. portable. Yeah. Your console is not portable, meaning that it's going to get lost or broken or stolen. Yeah. You're leaving you in the back of a of an airplane. Yeah, you're, yeah, yeah, exactly. It's gonna fly away. It's gonna people, fly away. People, oh people were God. pointing out again. The accessories cost there a lot. Saves. And people oh, were God. pointing out you can buy a dock on its own. You know, the dock you set it in oh, okay. and it's on your TV. You can buy a dock on its own. But it's like ninety bucks. What the it's like, fuck? Like, yeah, two all, all it is, all it does is store it to your TV. It's well, like, why does it cost? Now that I much? wonder. But, I really want somebody to add up. If I buy everything, every accessory, yeah, <laughs> how, what is the most I can spend to max it out? You know, but only purchasing like one game. I think know? I think someone did the math that if you're going to get like a second controller and maybe like the dock. Bonus dock and all that stuff, they they did the math and they were like, it actually. It's only a few bucks more to buy another Switch. <laughs> just buy two just Switches? Because you get all that in yeah. it. Yeah. And now, I wonder if, okay, let's say we both have a Switch and you have a yeah. game that I don't have. Yeah. And you want to take it to my house. Can you just take that? I bring it over and set it in? in your dock. That's kind of cool. And so, actually, and so, yeah, when people brought that up, it's like, what? It's that much for another dock? But it was like, well, I didn't know until you brought it up that I could do that. It, it, it just never occurred to me. It's like, I could get a dock in my bedroom, too. And at oh, any point, yeah. play it in yeah. either room. Like, I don't know. That was kind of cool. Oh, I, I, yeah, I but really for 90 bucks, that's not bad. But if it was, you know, 50, yeah. it'll go on if it was, sale. If it was it'll, 50, I'd have Black one, Friday I'd have one in every Amazon, room. Yeah. You know, yeah. it'll come back down. I and waited for the 3DS dock to come down. Well, that's it. Yeah, that's, uh, that's No, it switch. did. I got one now. I think that's pretty much everything that happened, though. But yeah. anyway, yeah. yeah. So that was a switch.